Shinkansen, which is the bullet train. We left our Airbnb back in Tokyo, heading towards Osaka now, which is Osaka is about three hour train ride. Next Airbnb, here we come. We're staying in Osaka for about six days, so this should be fun. It is now 11:48. We left this morning at nine o'clock. In Osaka, we have some plans. Beautiful music. Two main trips that we want to make. One, I think, Kobe, and then the other one is to Nara. Some of you might have seen before the beer that bow to you. It's like a park that's quite popular to tourists these days. And then the rest is um, exploring Osaka in general, like uh, Dotonbori, which is like a really famous little area. Well, we got our JR passes. Uh, 14 days. I've always wanted to ride a bullet train because it's so fascinating. These things are really, really fast. And they go so fast that you can't even really feel like all the shaking if there's any. I thought it would be really crowded, but to be honest, it's very spacious here. Look at this light bulb. A little context, I'm like 5 feet 10. We were able to get like space in the back, all the way in the back row for all our all our luggage. And we have really big luggages, so we have two big ones, I have a carry-on, and we have like our bags, plenty of space up on the top. So yeah, I'm excited, it's gonna be a good, relaxed ride. Okay, so check it. On this train, they have like, they have a bathroom right here, and another bathroom right here. And they have six here, another sink here. I love the views out here. So great, the Mount Fuji is actually on this way. Where Mount Fuji go? Somewhere out there. I think we kind of like lost line, line of sight. She's working on her thesis right now. It's about documenting life. I'm making a video. Such pro. It's a boxed lunch basically. Salmon, bro, crab. to our Airbnb cozy place. There's even directions on the floor. And the beds are huge. We're here. It smells really nice. There's an, a crazy view. Um, we have a washing machine. And there's a TV, Wi-Fi, the pocket Wi-Fi sort of deal. I like that clock. Amenities. Shower. Comparison, this is a little bit bigger, right? Yeah. Somewhere around two times bigger. This thing's actually really low. I'm sad we don't have um, a heater. Oh no, we do, but we're supposed to use the electric blanket. There's electric blankets. This <coughs> is <laughs> so stupid. Ow! Yo, what's up, guys? I am Yanja. <laughs> Grain of rice Dude, here. Close the door. <laughs> Should I be cool? Yo, what's up guys? Um, <laughs> he's cooler than me. Take three. What's up guys? This is grain of rice over here. It is right now. 5.03pm. <clears throat> um, grain of rice. <laughs> grain of rice back in the house. <laughs> Why are you laughing so much? <laughs> what is I feel like I'm a cry for no reason. Take, take 12. Grain of rice back in the house. <laughs> As you can see, there aren't many people around today because today is January 2nd and usually for the first few days of New Year's, it does get quite empty. Yeah, everyone's spending time with their families, going home, stores close, and I think they usually reopen around the 4th or so. 
But the place we're going, I mentioned before, uh, Dotonbori is open. It's a pretty popular place, so most of the shops probably will be open. So see you guys there. Sorry, I was a little crazy in the beginning. I don't know what's wrong with me. <laughs> I'm I'm fine now. I'm fine. <laughs> what's here? It's another life. Life Rai supermarket. Raifu. Nice raifu. We could buy more snacks from here. We're here! We're here! We're here! My brother's crazy. And the nice thing is water. I love when there's water nearby. It's not that and, cold. And not like sink water. <laughs> hey, I found you. Wait, this one? <laughs> Nani kore? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's their hotel. Don't tell buddy. Hotel. Where there is people, that is probably the center of this place. I can see the crowds already. Whoa, <laughs> that's a little crazy. Dude, that's crazy, but here's the famous crab that you see in everybody's shots. More takoyaki. Oh, so much food around. Still here. Alright. This dude's always on his phone. Do you smell that? Do you smell it? Oh, that guy in the back is good looking. <laughs> oh, Mino. So that guy's from Arashi. This is uh, Tomomi's favorite dude. Good looking guy. I feel like we've got to come back here like a, a bunch of times. It's actually really nice here. The yeah, fact that there's so nice. much food. There's so much stores, but there's actually a lot of food too. We're gonna check out Laos. We were thinking about doing a Get taste test. Keys with a whole bunch of matcha stuff but we have to find enough matcha things I see one candy chocolate um I have a problem I've showed you guys this in the vlog before these are the greatest thing ever and when a couple of my friends like supplied my addiction I told them when I come to Japan I'm gonna get my own we're buying a whole bunch of mail uh, matcha snacks in hopes of making a Matcha snacks taste test video always on his phone. Look at this dude. Look at him. Look at him. So this is like grilled crab. You get it out of the shell. Yeah, I have to get it out of the shell. The shell is very flimsy. It's got that very charred taste. The outside is really salty. Here goes for the meat. Very juicy. Very crab tasting like. It is a crab. I mean, it is a crab, but yeah. See what's in here? Oh, the taco head. I know that from Eat Your Kimchi, Simon Martino. You know, we keep wanting to have food, but then like we keep getting distracted by these souvenir shops. You don't even buy, buy anything half the time, you just come in here to like look. <laughs> See, like, we're getting some. Well, Lucky's getting a pair of Snoopy socks, keychain, and I'm getting this one. Two postcards of Osaka. Looks like we're going for ramen again. Line, line. Uh, I mean, it's, it's not too bad. Actually, it's not that bad. Hold on. Yeah. Want to wait here? Yeah, sure. Oh, wow. There's more. Dude, since I had like such a great experience at Ichiran Ramen, I want ramen today. It's always a safe choice, right? I love the seating situation here. Like, you can put your foot up and all and whatnot. Oh wait, that's not it. That's just the kids. English or Japanese? English. Okay. We have some kimchi. You got gave me some garlic chasu, which is pork roast pork reserve vegetables. Of course. They're made out of uh, chives. Ramen. Oh, chives. Yes, chives, green onions. It's a lot of kimchi. Hmm. Mm. So you put a lot of kimchi, so it's a bit spicy. It's a very light, light base, not Ichiran level, but good. This is actually a different atmosphere than Ichiran because in Ichiran you just sit there and you're like kind of closed off here. We're right out in the open, everyone can watch you eat and then you can watch everyone eat. But there's a lot of noise, so it's a kind of change in atmosphere, but I really like it. I don't know, I like both, honestly. Mm. Although I gotta say I like the I like the pork here better. Because it's actually charred. Look at that. Mm. 
the ramen on a rice scale, I would rate it two more than a scoop of rice. Not that it was Lucky's fault, but he did load it with a lot of kimchi and chives, and they're both really spicy, and I can't handle spice well. Of course, that should I shouldn't blame the shop for that. The flavor is good. I think the meat was a little hard for me because usually it's very tender and quote unquote melts in your mouth. Um, this was more, the meat was more lean and less fatty. The noodles were good. Um, the broth was a bit spicy. <laughs> Had extra meat, which was around $8, but the regular one is around 5 for a bowl. So I would say it's pretty worth it. Been having ramen like non stop these days. It's only been two days, but. Dude, there's so many food stalls here. There is here. There's just a few, but we just came from that side. Chicken wings! <laughs> There's everything. Yo. There's a heater here, and oh my god, it feels so nice. Heater in the middle of the street. This is how the world should be done. What am I doing? What am I doing? <laughs> what are we doing with our channel? <laughs> We're selling out. <laughs> You're selling. We're selling out to dab trends, the Asian dab. No stop. Stop embarrassing me. Squid skewer. Say no more. Oh, the sauce. Nice and tangy. Has a, like a very sweet, salty taste to it. Cooked to perfection. It was grilled. Oh. We're finishing the day off with some matcha ice cream. We got some matcha ice cream. Very, very small. It's a good, nice, small dessert. So it's very dark, as you can tell. So I'm hoping it really tastes a lot like matcha. You guys should follow Lucky on his Snapchat because he's always on Yeah, yeah, follow me on Snapchat because I'm always on Snapchat. So you guys get the latest and newest um, videos because we never upload. If you want to see live footage, you can see all the pictures on Snapchat. Oh, by the way, I'm the type of person that bites ice cream. <laughs> it takes a big bite. Good? Yes. Wow. Watch anything is good. Look at all the snacks we got. Oh, yeah. So, I'll show you guys when we get back. <laughs> So we are finally ending like, like seriously ending it. We're ending with takoyaki, which is very famous here in Osaka, I believe. Well, especially here in Dotonbori. Um, we decided to get this for no reason, honestly speaking. <laughs> this is like my fourth time having takoyaki because I really like it. And you can't go wrong. Great way to end the night with something warm. I really wanted to hold something warm because we are holding ice cream and I was just freezing off like freezing like crazy. We're gonna enjoy this takoyaki and we'll see you guys tomorrow. And as always, take my words with a grain of rice and some takoyaki. <laughs>